Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is my deck collection. Hey, today we're gonna look at some of my odds and ends decks. What are these? Uh, well, basically, this was like a long time before all the custom decks started coming out, long before like Illusionist started making custom cards. When I was a little kid, like when I was a teenager and I was collecting decks of cards, there was really nothing out there except for like bridge decks, bicycle decks, uh, just decks you'd pick up at amusement parks, decks you'd pick up, you know, when you went to an airport in a new state, uh, you know, and, or casino decks, you know, that was pretty much all you could collect back in the day. And so I was collecting cards even way back then. And so these are just some of the cards that I've picked up. And um, I've got three uh, shoe boxes full of these cards. Uh, the, you know, the shoe boxes that your vans come in, like these are literally van shoe boxes. And so uh, I'm gonna do three different videos. I'm gonna show you uh, how, how many of these random cards I have. There's not much to show you other than just to say, hey, this is part of my collection for those of you who've asked. So let's get to it. First off, I got a bunch of little of these mini decks. Uh, this is a Mickey Mouse deck, uh, comes in a little plastic box. Uh, this came from Disneyland, I think, or something, so a little mini deck. I also have a little mini deck um, from Toys R Us. So this is a vintage one, so long before uh, Toys R Us did the remodel and they became a different uh, store. These are uh, vintage uh, Toys R Us decks. And then I have two mini uh, Rider backs. So I have a mini in green and I have a mini in blue. I said earlier that you pick up decks of cards like when you're in a different state. Um, hard shelled plastic box, and I guess these are from Chicago. When I was at Disneyland, I picked up the Haunted Mansion deck, and then somebody else went to Disneyland apart from me, and they picked up the Haunted Mansion deck, and they thought, oh, I'd want them. So now I have two. I, I don't think I've ever even opened them. Again, they come in these little plastic boxes, and they're bridge size cards. I have no idea what this is. Like, literally on the back, it says deck of cards, deck of cards. So it's a cowboy and the state capital, and random country scenes, so it's like a country and western Americana deck. I have the in and out uh, shelled case deck. Um, I took the top off real quick just to show you what they look like. There are these transparent cards um, that, you, that are waterproof and you know, that you can get wet or they don't bend or break. So yeah, in and out cards. Another metal tin, uh, Edward Scissorhands, the movie. Yippee, I, I totally like Tim Burton and all of his stuff. So I'll show you the back, looks like that. Then I have a bunch of these double deck boxes that you use to play bridge with. And so you, it comes in a long box and then you get two decks. So those are the two decks that come in this box. It says, my cards, my rules, ideal, you lose. I got another double deck box that, where the backs of the cards, they look like money. Um, we'll even slide out, it looks like that. See, never even opened. So here's another double deck bridge size deck where the cards are plaid. Um, to show you what they look like, they're blue and red. Here's a double deck poker set of the Saturday Evening Post um, covers of Santa Claus. So there's both, of, that's what the backs look like. And again, it's in this tin box. Here's just a plain double bridge um, set. This is what the backs look like. This is what the faces look like. And I have an American Legend set of John Wayne uh, cards. I think my dad picked this up at Costco. So again, never even opened it. And then lastly, I have the Bicycle 2000 edition. So this came out in 2000. It was a tin box, but then coolly enough, inside, you actually get two cases. And so these were commemorative uh, when the year 2000 came out. And so uh, I really like these. These have a really cool back. Maybe I'll do a review on these one day. All right, so that was box number one. Uh, I'll do box number two and three later on, and I'll stick the links below in the description. Bye.